this island is lovely, but it isn't home. I'm missing a good old pasty and a walk through Mevagizzi. There's nothing like fending off seagulls while trying to eat, though even I daren't eat down in St. Ives. What I'd love today is a poem about something Cornish. Anything you like, don't need to be long, but I do like a good rhyme. Have a think. What do you like about Cornwall? When you've written one, stick it in the comments with your name and age and I'll read some out tomorrow. If you need some help, remember to ask an adult. You've got until 3.30pm today. <gasps> but before I go, let's have a look at your ships from yesterday. So, Jamie Mayhew, age 6 from Northamptonshire, sent in this beauty. Plenty of windows, let some light in. Ethan Henvest, age 9, drew the Sea Ripper. There's no shark getting through this hole. Alex Jones, age 11. Plenty of wind in those sails, and that skeleton out front should help maintain social distancing. Eight-year-old Darcy Pierce from Camborne has created the Super Ship. Shouldn't have any problems getting off the island with those jets and a laser gun. Freya, age four from Camborne, has sent me this lovely, colourful rainbow boat. Jack Henvest, age six, has set me up with a couple of nice rooms and some chairs. Loving the decor. Saren, age five, has given me some lovely colourful sails and the perfect rope ladder to reach the crow's nest. Madeline, age seven, has sent in this modern looking ship with a beauty of a ship's wheel. And finally, Lolly, age eight, has drawn this brilliant flying unicorn ship. They'd certainly see me coming. Thanks to everyone that sent me a picture. I love looking at them and it's given me some great ideas. Just need to find some wood. Nails, tools, a uh, crew.